Hey guys, and welcome back to Witcher 3. My name is Jagaris, and a quick apology for the gap in scheduling. The holidays got in the way, but we are back now with regular episodes of Witcher 3. Uh, and today we're going to be doing the Here Comes the Groom Witcher contracts. I think this is a Witcher contract sort of episode. Um, so let's go find Kevin. Hey, look, there's Kevin, and let's haggle out a price. See you not from round here. What's brought ye to speaker, Rock? I read your notice. Heard you've got a job for a witcher. Aye. My sister's near drilled a hole in me, got pestering me. I hung a notice, hoping she'd let up. Truth be told, didn't really expect anyone to take an interest. What's this about? My sister's betrothed. He's disappeared. Folks say he done a runner. Sis claims she saw a beast carry him off. And he's probably delicious. Sensing you just don't believe your sister. They had their ups, they had their downs. Nils, thoroughbred skirt chaser, and Brit's just not easy to be around. But family's sacred. You willing to look into this? So he thinks he's run off on her. All right, well, you're gonna have to pay me more. Finding Nils won't be easy. Reward you posted's not enough. Bring him home, and I'll spare no coin. Need to hear something specific. A sum. First, you gotta tell me something specific. What happened to Niels? Oh, this guy's cheeky. He's well cheeky. I still want uh 288. Well now, dunno. Would you <sighs> consider dropping it a bit? This guy's tight fisted, right? 266, final offer. Agreed. Agreed. See, because I said final offer, that's why he took the I'll deal. I'll see what I can do. Want to talk to your sister first off? Britt and Nils had their favorite spot, cliffs north of the village. Ever since he went missing, she's been wandering about there. Is that really Thanks. safe to just wander around the her. cliffs? I'm not convinced that's a sensible thing to do, Britt. Oh man, they're gonna put honey on my ass. That's well exciting. Oh, look at that cool roly poly. I'm like a ninja. Just like parkour Geralt. That's what I am. Parkour Geralt. Right. So, oh, a ram. I wonder what this guy, there must be a beast, right? Otherwise, what's the point of a witcher contract? Witcher contracts always have beasts. There's, it's always a beast. Wee beastie. Okay, here we are on the cliffs. I guess this isn't so far away that it would be dangerous to wander. Brit, I'm here to, to help you. To you. <laughs> Leave me be. No. Did you see Nils die? I, I, I saw a shadow, great wings, like a cloud passing over the sky. Then I heard him scream. Something grabbed him, lifted him up, then flew off towards the caves on the shore. But he was alive, screaming my name. I'll look into it. Nils is probably I'll dead. Those caves Brit mentioned. Jesus Christ, that's not very much information. 500 meters. All right, well, let's go. Hey, look, guys. It's a clan guard. <laughs> Topical Gwent jokes. Bandits. Yeah, you're dead. You're dead. Oh, Quen. Yeah, beauty. Oof, piss off. Jesus Christ, there's loads of bandits. Did one of them just shoot me with an arrow? You cheeky gif. You're dead now. Fucking shooting people with arrows. That's just not cricket. Why did he put his... Why did he put your sword away, Geralt? You crazy bastard. You're dead. We don't even need potions to beat up humans. You just may as well just wail on him. Nope. Countered. What the? You guys, he cheated. He's cheating. Nope. This is definitely cheating. This guy's a ghost. Nope. There we go. Oh! Cut his arm off. That's a bit gross. Right. 
Oh, I'm gonna have to like carry a bunch of like shitty weapons around and invariably get overwhelmed. Wait, there's another guy. Come on then, buddy. He's on the floor, just stab him. There we go. There we go. Right, well, I was on my way to these caves when, uh, whoops. I was on my way to these caves when I was rudely interrupted by some bandits. What have you got though? Let's get some goodies. Emerald dust and a runestone. And, ah, oh, diamond dust's all right, I guess. Should probably loot these guys. That'll probably do. Right, let's get back on track. Which is literally here. See, here is the track. Okay, so, we're gonna go explore the caves uh, using our Witcher sensors and hopefully figure out what's happened to Brit's lad. I hope he's not dead, but he's probably, like, realistically, he's probably dead. Although I feel like it's a bit of, like, they're paying me to find out that he's dead. Although I guess they're paying me to kill whatever killed him, right? Realistically, that's what's happening. Here we are at the cave. The cave of wonders. Wait, 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 Herb. No, come, come here. Come here. No, come here. There we go. There we go. Oh, look at these little crabs. There's a whole team of them. A whole flock. I don't think a group of crabs is called a flock. Someone tell me what a group of crabs is called. Stinks of carrion. Right, I need my torch. There we go. Drowners. Is the drowner a necrophage? Uh, oh, he's dead. Can I not loot him? Apparently not. Ooh, siren blood. Tracks. A very big siren. What even is a siren? Humanoid, I guess. Let's... Let's use this potion. Ow, you cheeky bastard! Hey, dodged. Dodged. I'm gonna chop you up. Oh, fucking rude. There we go. Can I loot you? Don't mind if I do a little bit of hair. Very stylish monster hair. Got some water. Oh, there's freaking drowners everywhere. Well, this is clearly a cave full of monsters. Let's just chug a swallow while we're at it. Oh! Oh! Not today, folks. Wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna use odd. But now I don't have my torch yet. Girl, where's your torch? Let's just give us a second. We'll pull it out. There it is. There it is. Look, he's running away! Nope. Alright. Well, we are dealing more or less with the drowners. Where do we go from here? Aha, what's this? Melusine, the mad and dangerous lady of the depths. What? Clearly used to be worshipped here. Okay, so that's like an old god. Why did he put his torch away? Geralt, let's... What's this? Strange scale color. Not your everyday siren. Same scales as on the altar. Strange scale, scale color. color. Here out of nowhere. Not your everyday the siren. Living in a while. Went into hibernation some time ago, but it's awake now, and it's hungry. Oh, I have to find Melusine? whatever that is. Um, more drowners. Guess we'll deal with these fuckers. Show me what you got. Stop putting your torch away, Geralt. Right, one sec. We can't use... Let's use Axie. Because clearly this isn't working. I switched to Axie! I'm pretty sure I switched to Axie. Maybe not. There we go. Boom! Stunned. Dead. Come on. He doesn't know what to do. Did another one just pop out of the sea? He did. There we go. Uh, let's use Thunderbolt while we're at it. Oof. Good job. 
and then we'll loot everything. Monster blood. I have all this monster stuff. I never use it for anything. I'm guessing we go up here. This looks about right. Yeah, see, look, there's a trail. Out we go. Plus, it would be better if we fought out in the open, because I have to use this stupid torch I keep putting away. Come on, you come. Girl, you can climb that. There we go. This is where she's not here. Oh. Oh, no. Poor Nils. Nils. Gotta be. Some monster dropped him from high up. Brit wasn't lying. Here comes the monster! Don't I have a horn that's good against sirens? I don't know if it does anything though. Like, let's try this horn. No, no, this one. Causes sirens to drop out of the sky. It didn't work. Still didn't work. Okay, we're just gonna cross that work. I'm just gonna, I guess just keep shooting her. Hey, come on, I've shot you about eight times. Get out of the air. This is not a very exciting battle. Oh shit, I'm bleeding, I'm bleeding. Uh, Quinn, 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 Quinn. Swallow potion and Quinn. Okay. You missed. Can I use Quinn? There we go, I can use Quinn. Right, there we go. We've done like a third of our health by shooting crossbow bullets at her. This is totally cheese. Such a cheese way of doing this fight. I guess we could try and art her. Whew. Alright, I'll wait till she comes at me. Nope, she's still not at me yet. She's almost dead at this point. My, my fingers are getting tired from hitting the shoot the arrow button. <laughs> this is definitely not how you're meant to do this. One more. Oh, you cheeky bitch. I guess we'll Quen. Boom. Nailed it. Where did, where did her body go? Uh huh. Easy peasy. Ek, ek, echidna. She's an echidna. Get a little cutscene of me taking out my knife, throw it, catch it, and then stab. I may have seen this sequence quite like quite a few times. Okay, right, so I guess now we head back and get our reward. Man, that was a tough fight, you guys. That was a tough fight. Whee! Oh man, that was well cool. Right, we're back, Kevin. Give me my money. Master Witcher? Got rid of the beast. Found an old echidna in a cave on the shore. Tough beast, but I killed it. So Brit spoke true? A beast took Nils? And killed him. Body's in the cave. I'll have to fetch it. Witcher, would ye mind telling Brit what happened to her betrothed? Uh, fine. Fine. I'll talk to her. It's the least she deserves. Feel like a damn fool now, not believing my own sis. Yeah, you're a terrible brother. Take this. Hard work deserves payment. Farewell. You should pay me double, to be honest. Bet you he didn't, but you should. <laughs> Rude as heck. Alright, let's go tell Brit. We are the bearer of bad news. But we look really fantastic in our cat armor, so hopefully she won't be too upset. I'm thinking like if I look really spiffy, she'll probably be like, well, this guy's handsome, so, you know, 
it'll, it'll, it'll provide her with condolence to hear the bad news from such a good looking fellow. Brett, he's dead. Need to talk to you. <laughs> Leave me be. You said that already. Your betrothed is dead. An echidna captured and killed him. Nels. This won't bring him back, I know. But I avenged him. Killed the beast. Thank you. Knew all along he was true to me. And so I'll vow to be true to him for the rest of my days. What? He's... <sighs> take this gold. It ain't much. But I want you to take it. I don't need her payment, you know. Thank you, but I won't accept any coin from you. Why do you offend me so? Don't take it the wrong way. There are things even a witcher shouldn't take coin for. Hey, sorry, Brit. I mean, I guess I could have taken her money. But, I mean, she just vowed that for the rest of her days, she's basically going to be, like, single. Like, I mean, I, I feel like you'll get over it, you know? You'll get over it. And then you'll meet a nice, handsome man, and you'll be like, oh, man, if only I hadn't, like, vowed to be single for the rest of my life. And we could have had beautiful children, but no. Oh, well. Right, let's find another contract. We've offended him, Sven. The woodland spirit seeks revenge. This here is him saying we've strayed from the old paths. Offended him? The monster's killed five already. He doesn't give a rat's arse about paths or tracks or me or you. He's a plowing beast from the plowing forest. Split his ribcage. A strong one, this spirit of yours. That's so. And who might you be? I am Geralt, and I'm here to solve your woodland spirit problem. Oh my god, I'm terrified. I solve problems. And if we can agree terms, I can solve yours. He's a witcher. A killer for hire. This village is home to decent folk only. You won't find any work here. Sure about that? Beast that did this, it's aggressive and incredibly strong. I can help you for a price. I like this man. Play your trade, Witcher. I believe we will agree terms. And I like this man. Oh man, we're actually going to fight the Woodland Spirit. I'm terrified. Who or what is this Woodland Spirit? Tell you what, it's not. Any of your concern. Mate, piss it's off. It's a common beast. Murders any man who ventures into its territory. Exhaustive as descriptions go. What does this spirit look like? Anyone seen it for themselves? No man alive has. Great. Really helpful, all of you. <laughs> it's totally a lesson. Birds pecked apart his entrails. And here, tooth marks. A large dog. A wolf, maybe. This the way it always kills? Only cowards. True warriors. Men with the hearts of predators. The spirit grants them an honorable death. This guy is strange. You said the creature wants revenge. Why? For what? Our forefathers hunted with spear and knife. This pleased the woodland spirit. He let us live in peace. We never knew hunger. He killed back then too. He's always killed. How many lads died trying to become hunters? Now since our hunters died in the war, the beasts turned even more bloodthirsty. We are uncreate. What others buy with gold, we buy with our lifeblood. We are slaves to fear spread by blind fools like you. These woods are ours. High time we put an end to this beast. I like this guy. He's almost as good as Roche. And that's, that's a high praise from me. I've heard enough. You've got a monster problem, that's clear. Just not sure you want it solved. Oh, we do. Come see me. We'll figure us a fair price for the beast's head. Our little talk while I looked over the corpse? Not nearly enough. Need to look around, figure out what I'm up against. Be not rash, killer. It's not too late to bring back the old ways. I'll decide what to do. But start collecting coin, just in case. Friends, we show hard right, we are dealing with this, this woodland eyes. spirit. He's Examine the tracks in the woods using your witch sense. To find out that it's a lesson. Uh, other tracks? Aha, uh -huh. tracks. Got a trail to follow. Wonder where it leads. I want to follow the trail. Following trails never ended well. I guess it goes this way. Aha. Uh -huh. Thin and deep cuts. Bottom like a razor. 
There's a dead doggo. And then what's this? Uh, does this... Oh, apparently I have to follow the dotted line. So I do have to go this way. Aha. Uh -huh. What else have we got? Like, some big stones? Is this another guy tied to a stick? Yeah, Smash it looks like bones. it. That takes strength. No point in trying to parry its blows. Okay, so if it tries to hit me, I should block it, basically. Wolves. I will kill you. Oh, dear. Uh, where did he come from? He just appeared out of nowhere. All right, come here, buddy. There's only room in this town for one white wolf. And I'll give you a clue, it's not you. Missed. Hey. Let's grab some dog tallow while we're at it. Okay. Let's have a wee look around. Um... There's more wolves, I'm going to be annoyed. Aha! Aha! Sharpened its claws, or just marked off its territory. Possession. Male. Very old. Damn it. Probably marked one of the villagers. Oh, I wonder which one it marked. Maybe it's that one that keeps arguing about how it's a great creature. Learn more about Leshens in the bestiary. Uh, I only know it's a lesson because I encountered one way at, like right at the start of the let's play. They're gonna be cursed ones. Nope. It's not gonna be draconid. Nope. Hybrid. I guess not. Unless it's down. No. Nah. Okay. Uh, I don't think it'd be ogroid relict. It must be a relict, right? Leshens. Haha. We never hunt in these woods, never, even if it means the whole village starves. Leshens dwell in dense primeval woods, fiercely territorial creatures they hunt with stealth and cunning as their only companions. They use their inborn magic to control the plants and animals within their territory, and so when stalking them, half the battle is merely getting near enough to strike. Leshens old enough to earn the Appalachian Ancient wield advanced skills and tactics that make them particularly dangerous. Dimmertian bomb, relict oil, and igni. Okay, do I have, do I have relic oil? I don't know. Like, I feel like, you know, Sven must be, like, because Sven wants to kill it, right? Whereas Harold doesn't want to kill it, which means I think Harold is possessed. Unless it's like a bamboozle and Sven is possessed. But, you know, I, I don't think, I don't think we're getting, like, bamboozled. Like, I don't think it's that. Oh, wait, I want to talk to Sven. But there's Harold. Let's, let's speak with Harold. Maybe I should just speak to Sven, but Harold is nearer. Didn't have many friends, did he? Folk aren't willing to look at this kind of death today. But in the past, I remember I was just a lad. Lugos Herlip led a raid on our village. Found nothing but silence and fog. I could barely make out my pa and my uncles lying in wait behind the trees. I remember how they hunted down one warrior after another, and once they surrounded Harelip himself, well, I believe he'd rather have faced the woodland spirit. Your spirit is a very old lesson. He's dangerous, but I should be able to deal with him. Rid us of him, yet he's what made us invincible, turned us into great warriors. Um, but it's a monster. Maybe I wasn't clear. The woodland spirit is a monster. Cut with the sword, he'll bleed and die. Like you, like me. He's much more. Thanks to him, the woods team with game, and our women bear strong babes. The power of the woodland spirit makes us the best hunters in the isles. True, not every lad who sets out to be a hunter survives the sacred ritual. But aren't witchers made at similar cost? 
I don't think it's the same. So what does he Back want us to do? Tree, you said you know another way to stop the Leshen. We must return to the old path. Restore the old ways. Roam the woods with knife and spear. Fight on even terms and prove our valor. That would please him. Our ancestors placed the Covenant Stone in the woods, laid sacrifices of prized game on it, and thus made a pact, do as they did. Go south along the brook, submit to the trial by burning a sacrifice of wolves' hearts on the sacred spot. Uh, I don't know. I guess we should speak to Sven. I haven't decided what to do yet. Try to kill the woodland spirit? And you'll bring his wrath upon us all? Uh, we'll see. Gotta give this some thought. So long. Right, let's go speak to Sven and see what he thinks, and then make a decision from there. What up, Sven? Went to look at the tracks in the woods. Spirit sure knows how to make an impression on intruders. Told you, he likes killing. Almost certain we're dealing with an old lesson. An ordinary beast, then. Just as I said. I mean, it's just a monster. Mm -hmm. I handle creatures like that. I know how. I can kill them for you, provided you have the coin. Oh, don't you fret. We'll have the gold. Just one small problem. The Leshen's marked one of you. As long as that individual lives near its domain, the beast can't be killed. Not completely. Sooner or later, it'll be reborn. Must be one of the elders. Harold, I'm sure of it. You heard him. Words aren't enough. Gotta find the mark my way. Folk won't believe you. They'd never listen to an outsider accusing one of their own. But you find the marked one, and I'll handle the rest. Gotta use my senses. Find the one marked by the woodland spirit. I feel like ultimately it's a monster, right? And my job is to kill monsters, so we should probably just kill it. Like, in the long term, if it's killing multiple people over, like, hundreds of years, I feel like... Probably just dealing with it is the smartest thing to do. And then the people can live in, like, happiness or what have you. Is it Bjorn? It's not Bjorn. What am I looking for? Will Sven visit today? Oh, that might be what I'm looking for. No? But there's all these crows. Galeshin's chosen the girl. Damn it. Hilda. Oh, because she was surrounded by crows. Okay. Oh man, I bet Sven's into Hilda. He's not going to be happy about this. So, find out who's mates with the beast? It's not intentional. The marked individual has no idea. You don't know the elders like I do. Every last one of them codgers would surrender his mother to please the monster. And no point in mincing words. Said yourself, the monster's helper must die first. Uh. No, but then the Leshen will go. I think we have to kill her. If you want me to kill the Leshen, you gotta get rid of the marked one. Do you hear the Witcher, people? If we want to live, we gotta slaughter the That's elders. not what I said! No mercy! No! Ugh! It's Hilda. The Leshen's marked Hilda. Hilda? Kill the witch. Hilda? But she's one of us. No mercy, Sven. We all heard you. I'm sorry, Sven. Take her. I mean, maybe she doesn't have to be killed. Maybe she could have been exiled, but Thought sometimes like it's just how it is. I did what I had to do. Your turn. Oh, it's like a scream. Now I feel bad. All right, we gotta kill the Leshen totems, okay. Sorry, Hilda. Uh, that's just kind of how life goes. But I think, sorry, dude. Ultimately, it's like Leshen's one person. Begins here. I need to destroy all the totems before I find the beast. But like I said, it's only one person, right? So then, if we can stop the, if we can stop the Leshen, then no one else has to die, which seems kind of useful. This thing. How do I destroy it? Maybe Ard. That works. That works. Ugh, I'm stuck in a tree. Okay. 
I wonder what happens if you tried to do it Harold's way and just like accept the sacrifice. I don't know, that doesn't seem, that doesn't sit well with me. Yeah, well, you know, some people die so long as we do what we can to appease this creature. Let's switch to Igni. Ooh, yeah, cheeky gear. Right, that's one. Then if that one's on fire, oh, I didn't catch up there. I'm gonna say, while that one's on fire, we can kill this other one, but it's fine. Nailed it. Is that it done, or is there something then to knock over? I can hear the crows, which means there's probably like a totem. There it is. Oh, they're well creepy. Boom. Okay. And then more wolves, maybe? We should switch to Igni. Oh, I hit the totem by accident. Whoops. Right, I'm gonna have to kill its like little bros. Both bros are dying. Oh man, this, like the sad dog noises that they make them make, like the whines, are quite upsetting. Oh well. You know, it had to be done. It had to be done. Greater good. I can't be bothered to loot all these, right. Find the lesson using your witcher sense to follow the sound it makes. Okay. I've only got one I've only got one uh swallow potion. So we have to be careful. Oh Jesus. This is a terrible decision. This is a terrible, terrible decision. Uh, so we want Igni and Thunderbolt. Right, we kill the wolves first. I mean, at least the wolves are very easy to kill. Where is the Woodland Spirit? Where is it? Ah, there it is. I think we have to just, like, dodge. I don't think we can parry. Just get away from him. Where have you gone? Like, he's made of wood, so setting him on fire seems kind of sensible. Now run, 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 run. And then we'll drink a swallow as well. Maybe we can apply Quen while we're at it. There we go. And then switch back to Igni, because he takes a little while to reappear. So by the time he's appeared, Igni should be back up. More or less. Hmm. There he is. Where's he gone? He's on fire again. Oh, I was meant to use relic oil as well. I just realized I forgot about my oils. Uh, I mean, he's nearly dead at this point. We can probably just get him. Oh, you cheeky git! Ow! Stop it! No more wolves. Holy shit. That actually didn't hurt too much. And now you're dead. Is he dead? He did. Yoink, 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 yoink. Don't mind if I do. Pull out my knife. Throw my knife. Catch my knife. Stab. I never actually, like, argued a reward, though. This guy better pay me well. Hey, Roach. Where did, where did Roach come from? It's just like, now Roach is here. I mean, maybe the Woodland Spirit summoned Roach. Could you imagine? Okay, well, let's head back to... Sven and collect our reward. And here we are back at the village. Why is. What the fuck? Why are there all these bodies on the floor? Sven! Sven, what did you do? Hey! hey! Look at this. Told you the Witcher had solved this. What happened? You rid us of the beast, we rid ourselves of its accomplices. Don't worry, our agreement stands. I earned your coin, you did. Did he just kill everyone?
Uh, why did why? <sighs> like they, they had nothing, nothing to do with it. Changed. Leshen's gone, true, but a murderer still haunts the village. Your work is done, Witcher. You've done your part, and I've done mine. Uh But like why would you kill them all? They didn't do anything. Think the village will go along with this? Folk will calm down. Realize the guilty needed to be punished. But they hadn't done Do anything. Fear will not rule my village. There will be no more killings. Go to your homes. And you, Witcher, on your way. No more monsters left around here. That doesn't feel good. Ooh. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. That was a messed up quest. Like, that was a messed up quest. Holy shit. I wonder what would have happened if you'd gone with Harold. Like, do you think he would have tried to kill them anyway? It seems like there was going to be a... I don't know if there was going to be, like, um... Tension regardless of what you did, but... I mean, I feel like killing the, the Leshen was still the right choice. But holy smokes, he killed, like, everyone. Anyway, guys, let me know in the comments below what you chose to do and how it turned out. Um... And let me know what the collective name is for a group of crabs. If you like this episode, you can always leave a like and you can always subscribe to the channel for more Witcher. Um, yeah, beyond that, you can follow me on Twitter, uh, twitter.com forward slash Jagras, and you can find me on uh, Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash Jagras. Have a fantastic day. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, hopefully, I'll catch you in the next episode. Bye.